Professor Sarah Wilford, author of three books on early childhood development, is a professor of psychology at Sarah Lawrence College in Bronxville, New York. Wilford explains what's pushing parents to buy videos that claim to make their kids smart. Where's the pressure coming from, though? I think the pressure in the society on parents is coming uh, largely from the pace, from the pace of life, and that includes um, working long hours, having to figure out who's going to take care of your kid. How is that going to be a, a situation that you feel safe and comfortable with? They talk about quality time. I'm rushing home from my job. I've got to make dinner and maybe not spending quite enough time with my child. So I've got to do something extra. Valuing the time you have, I think, is, is hugely important. Scheduling a lot of stuff or getting the kinds of toys that are supposed to make kids smart, um, that's, that can work against you. Think about those pieces of playfulness between you that are really important. They may not go on very long. It can happen as you're giving a bath. They can happen as you're fixing dinner. Where does the input coming from that maybe it's not so good to be so structured and sitting there in, in, their, in your, the downtime you have with your flashcards versus just playing? How do you know? Where do you learn it? Teachers of young children do know a great deal about the importance of play. Now, the pressures of No Child Left Behind and standardized testing, paper and pencil tests coming down the road may be nerve-wracking and, and scary for teachers and for parents, but I don't believe that means that the teachers don't really know that play is important. One of the things that I wondered was, uh, what happens in the long run? I know, I think, having been director of the Early Childhood Center for, for you know, 20 odd years and following kids who went on in public school uh, and private school as well, that they, they left our program uh, pretty confident about who they were as people. And you can't buy that, and you can't teach that, and you can't force that. You can only foster it as a process.